Hello there, people! Because they never end, it's time to check out yet another um, QC base modification. This time around, we're checking out Rockets with Guided Lightning by Stowe. Um, this basically will change your rockets into flying lightning guns, which throw lightning in the direction that the person who shot it is facing. Um, so yeah, that's basically it. Um, just throw lightning basically where you're shooting at. Um, it's great for shooting people around the corners. Now, you can still aim after the missile is launched, but you have to keep aiming the lightning. When you run away, who knows who or what it'll hit. Um, the lightning doesn't sprout until after 0 0.5 seconds, so it's useless for close combat. Um, the impact doesn't hurt. So it's, yeah, a simple quick hack, but nice. So, yeah, pretty simple, straightforward and whatnot, basically... Just makes it into that. Let's, let's check this thing out. Get it underway and see what exactly in God's name we've gotten ourselves into this time. Because the world is a cruel place and filled with just things that hate me. Impulse 90. It still worked because 9. Okay, let's see here. This is the worst guided lightning rod thing ever. Yeah. Let's actually make sure I actually moved over the progress of that. Because I feel like I didn't. Knowing me. Did I even compile it outright? I don't know. Hmm. That might actually be worth the attempt. To find out if I actually did this or not. That this is all important stuff, people. Mysteries of the universe. Did I actually fully compile this stupid thing out? This is why, like... Fully compiled progs are dead files are nice just for rec recording. <laughs> you know, it's like the rest of it I can like do when I like move over the code as needed. But yeah, this part is like the annoying part. Trying to find figure out if you know you got something working or not before you like go into there and actually load it up. So um yeah, I think I transferred over. There we are. I think oh wait, now I'm just gonna load up my compiler again. See, this is why I hate bloody DOS bots, because it's like you can't just load up, you know, two programs, so I don't know, now I have to go back into here and change around um, the Iowa Zuck line. Wait, which, like I said, isn't the biggest of deals, but it is a little annoyance, especially since I'm very easily going to click one button, think it's doing one thing, when it's going to do another. Um, it's just not as nice to say, load up two programs on your computer. Yeah, that, that would be a lot nicer, if I could have two programs. What, what an amazing concept. Okay, this is definitely confusing. Like, I see it. But yeah, it's like really... Like, I'm not really getting anywhere with this, am I? Like, yeah, I'm pretty much defenseless to this thing, because it's like the rocket takes so long to appear that, yeah, you need to be, like, halfway across a room. It's hard to guide it in this tight area. Where's, like, an open area in Quake? We need a giant open freaking area. Like, a giant open courtyard. My God. Like, I'm trying to think even what would, like... Yeah, this will help me out. I think this is working. Either that or it's just shooting at walls. So that's the problem. How do you aim at what you want to aim at? That? Um, yeah, it feels like at this rate, like... I'm trying to figure out how you guide this stupid thing. Like, I figured maybe it would be like a guiding missile. But yeah, I'm not really sure what exactly... Like, is it shooting where I target? Let's see here. This is a good test. I need to get to like a... Level where I can actually fire rockets without it be a problem. 
Yeah, see, it's based on where you're looking. You guide it based on where you're looking, and the rocket flies. See, yeah, you shoot, like, over there. There you do. You're shooting that way. You shoot over here, you shoot this way. See, it's all based on where you're facing. It's where the lightning shoots. My God, is that going to be a tough system to try and deal with? Especially since you can't really do, like, close things at all. And, yeah, it's very indirect. Like, yeah... Like, even try to do simple things, like... It's like trying to get, like, this grunt. It's like you have to face this way. I'm not sure if I actually can face around or not. But yeah, as you see, it's like a matter of... You gotta be facing the direction you wanna face it. I love it, he's getting constantly alerted. Yeah, it's like, they don't actually get alerted until they see you. So you see, if you hit it with the lightning, it's actually pretty good, but it's just rough to hit things with lightning. But yeah, it's like it doesn't alert enemies, it's just a really funky system. Anyway, that's all it really is. There's no, like, death messages or really anything custom like that. Yeah, it's just a really simple, straightforward, um, well, hack for this thing that allows you to basically shoot, um, random beams of light and stuff. So yeah, really straight, really straightforward and simple. Not really something that really is that intuitive or really fun at all to really work with. It's more of a pain than anything trying to control this sort of thing. It's a really unintuitive system. So um, anyway, thank you all for watching. It's been an adventure. I guess I shall see you all next time.